Hello and welcome to Coloring with Parkinson's. Today I am super excited to show you Happy Mail. This is the cutest coloring book I think I've been sent from all the way from Poland. It came super fast and very, very well packaged. First of all, the sticker is really, really cute. A good representation of what's to come inside. So first of all, I have to say that this artist packaged everything extremely well and careful. Not only did she include bonus items, they were extremely well packaged, better than I've ever seen, and I've bought a lot of coloring books. <laughs> but this card, this is not only cute, but very sweet. There's a lovely dedication there that I'll let you guys read. It's just super pretty and thoughtful. So I'm gonna dive right into it because this is super cute and I'm very excited to show you guys everything that's inside. Um, I did receive, I think this must be larger than a eight and a half by 11, but these grayscale um, like mini posters, super, super cute. And I have these extras that are like, uh, this one's her information where you can find her on Etsy. Mariola Budek Art, she's on Etsy. And this is a wonderful way to advertise your information and show off your work in a lovely like bookmark form. I think this is pretty brilliant. And as you can see, I am trembling right now, so uh, um, I might have to slow down a bit, but I'm gonna keep going. I did manage to save a sticker from today's mail because I thought it was super cute. I particularly like this one a lot with the beautiful female and wolf hair. And it is two sided. I think this is just absolutely gorgeous. This is another stunning one with a horse and a girl. Two-sided, she's all tied it down. And this is the first time ever that I've received a coloring book with such excellent protective gear. This not only has a nice thank you for supporting her small business, but it's a hard board that was on top to protect the inside. In addition to all the wrapping that it came in, everything was in plastic. And this is very cool because it's a different kind of coloring book. I'll quickly show you the bottom piece. It's a simple board that you put at the bottom with foam pieces in the middle and that protects the bottom and the top. So she's got that covered. I'm gonna move everything out of the way to show you how this coloring book works because I think it's actually genius. Let me just get everything put aside here. Okay, let's take that away. Okay, this is different. They have this plastic bind that you slip off. And I'm doing it carefully because I am shaking so let me see if I can do it for you guys. It's a little difficult for me at the moment, but I'm still gonna give it a go. Ah, here we go. Okay. So this is, I think, pretty genius. Simple and easy to take off, even for me. And she's got all her information here, the uh, name of the book, how many pages, and her name. So I thought that was cool. Excellent way for me to scan everything in case I Make a mistake, I can always reprint it. This is the cover. So when you open it, you have the flap, it says Happy Coloring and her uh, signature. And when you open it, it does tell you how to take it off. And these are spaces to test your different mediums because not all pencils will color well on any piece of paper. So you can test out your um, color pencils, markers, pastels, 
whatever you got this would be the, uh, the place to do it so that's the cover okay and then um, I'm gonna dive right into it this is the first uh, page and she does have them numbered in case you take this all apart you can put it back to um, in its correct order. Okay. I'm going to turn it this way to keep myself in order here. And I'm going to do the flip through. I think this one's really adorable. It's a very cute little girl. Super cute. I think this one's really adorable, but there's so many. I just about love every single one. They're all very precious. Is that not adorable or what? This one is very sweet. This is a good one for Easter, I think. I think they're very beautiful and it's large, good quality paper, it's heavy, one-sided. Again, how I like for the markers and stuff, or mediums, watercolor mediums, I should say. This one is extremely cute. This is cute, a little girl and her cat. That's very precious. I think I'm going to color this one first, just because I think he's adorable. I mean, I love them all, but that one I might color first, but I am torn between that one and this owl. But you can see how incredibly talented this artist is, very talented and creative, and she packages everything so carefully and beautifully. It was worth every penny I spent. I would have probably spent more if she asked for it. <laughs> this one I like a lot. I love coloring dragons. And I think this one's cute because it's a boy and his dragon. Watching the other ones fly around. This is cute, little witch. I love this one. I love Halloween and haunted houses, and I think this is a great one for me to do as well. Look at this beautiful shading and technique, and very endearing. Look at that one. Cuteness. They're just, they're all very stunning images. I love that they're grayscale because gray it's easy for me to color. They're so beautiful and adorable and they're not too busy. For people like me that have health issues or mobility issues, it's easy for me to color and it's not overly intricate something i could really enjoy and frame if you wanted to this is from the sticker this is a character from the sticker she put on the mail i love this one 
and this is the back cover so you have the flap like a normal color book but then you have the index inside here which is a good way to um test your mediums you can you know give it a, a little test on these images without damaging the page i for when i'm going to scan everything because i shake i make mistakes so i like to um scan and reprint if necessary and i'm going to hold this up so you guys can see her information i'm going to try to scoot in there and uh, i will also link it in case anybody wants to buy from her she's an amazing artist and she responds quickly when you message her and that's it guys you just grab everything and put it back together and it's not too difficult even for me it takes me a second but it's not too hard to put the bind back on give it a good tap and then just slide it back down and you're good this is the back of the page that has the numbers and uh, a title. Thank you so much for watching. Please leave your comments.